Good morning friends. I hope everyone is doing well. I request everyone to watch my videos in a sequence for better understanding. If you really like my videos, please press the like button, share the videos with your friends, subscribe to my channel and even press the bell button to get the regular updates. In this video, I want to discuss about what is the need for a transmission medium and how the transmission medium is classified into two categories such as guided transmission medium and unguided transmission medium. Then further, the guided transmission medium is classified into the twisted pair cables, coaxial cables and fiber optical cables. Coming to the unguided transmission medium, it is again classified into three types. One is radio waves, microwaves and infrared. So, we will discuss all these things in detail. So, let me discuss about what is the need for a transmission medium. The transmission medium is useful for us to transfer the data between the devices. Or let's take that uh, someone is speaking in with someone. Okay, a person is speaking with another person. Now, whatever the person is speaking, how it will be able to listen by the another person? Because the air is a medium which is carrying the voice of the person to another person. Am I right or wrong? So, we need to have a medium to transfer the data. Okay. So, the medium can be classified into the transmission medium is is broadly classified into two types. One is the guided transmission medium and we have unguided transmission medium. The guided transmission medium can even called as a wired communication whereas unguided transmission medium we will call it as a wireless communication. Okay. So, the guided transmission medium is again classified into three types. One is twisted pair cables and we have coaxial cables and we have fiber optical cables. Okay. So, totally we have three types of guided transmission medium. And then the twisted pair cables is further classified into shielded twisted pair cables. Let me write it as STPC, shielded twisted pair cables and unshielded twisted pair cables. And then unguided transmission medium is again classified into three types. One is radio waves. And we have microwaves and we have infrared. And in the unguided transmission medium, the electromagnetic waves plays a major role. And everyone, I think everyone know the electromagnetic spectrum. In the electromagnetic spectrum, we will have the radio waves, microwaves, infrared, visible light and we have X-rays and gamma rays. The X-rays and gamma rays, all these things will not be useful for communication, whereas the radio waves, microwaves and infrared can be used for the communication. So, the range of the radio waves is 3 kilohertz to 300 megahertz. So, this is the frequency range of a radio wave according to the electromagnetic spectrum. And the microwaves frequency range is from 300 megahertz to 300 gigahertz. And infrared is having the range from 300 gigahertz to 400 terahertz. Okay. So, these are the frequency ranges of radio waves, microwaves and infrared. Now, we will come to the twisted pair cable. Why it is called as a twisted? Why these wires are copper wires are twisted? To avoid the crosstalk and the noise. And then coming to the shielded, we will have a 
शील्ड टू प्रोटेक्ट फ्रॉम द इलेक्ट्रोमैग्नेटिक इंटरफ्रेंस ओके सो ट्विस्टेड पेयर केबल्स वन केबल विल वन कॉपर वायर विल बी यूजफुल फॉर ट्रांसफरिंग द डाटा अनदर वन इज यूज फॉर द ग्राउंड रेफरेंस ओके सो वाई दे हैव ट्विस्टेड इज दट टू रिड्यूस द क्रॉस टॉक एंड वी हैव ए कोवाक्सल केबल्स एंड वी हैव द फाइबर ऑप्टिकल केबल्स कमिंग टू द फाइबर ऑप्टिकल केबल्स दे आर वेरी कॉस्टली एज कंपेर टू दिस ट्विस्टेड पेयर केबल्स एंड द coaxial cables and it is very difficult for them to maintain also also if any fiber optical cable breaks it is very difficult to have means joining all these fiber optical cables okay now you can ask me sir where and how should i select the transmission medium like if i want to transfer the data between two devices what kind of transmission medium i should choose should i choose the guided transmission medium should i choose the unguided transmission medium if i choose the guided transmission medium should i go for the twisted pair cables coaxial cables fiber optical cables which one should i go you will have a confusion so how you will choose is that you will have a factors the factors are one is the transmission range not transmission range transmission rate means how fast the data should be transferred from the source to the destination okay so based on the transfer rate you will go for the guided or unguided and if it is guided which one you want to select you will select it and another important thing is that based on the distance between the source and the destination the distance also plays a major role in selecting the guided or unguided okay and another one is the cost and ease of installation and maintenance ease of installation and also maintenance because the cost is also important and ease of installation and maintenance also very important and fourth factor plays a major role is that environmental condition in which environment you want to go for the transmission medium okay so i hope you have understood what is the transmission medium what is the guided and unguided transmission medium how to select a, a guided transmission medium and our unguided transmission medium based on the parameters or the factors i hope you have understood all this concept in the coming videos i will discuss about the twisted pair cables and coaxial cables fiber optical cables and even the unguided transmission medium such as radio waves microwaves and infrared in detail okay so don't worry please watch my videos in a sequence so that you will learn everything in regarding the computer networks course thank you for watching my video have a nice day